Hello people, subscribers, viewers. My name is Olivia, or Fierce Livy, and today we're gonna be stretching our shoulders. This is a follow along edition stretching routine, so make sure to follow along. And I know a lot of you guys are trying to get your scorpions in needles, and this video will really help you with that, or any other trick you know of that requires shoulder flexibility. Let's go. We're first gonna start out with some basic shoulder stretches and go from there. Must be something underneath Take two I'm still trying to figure out what makes you Hard on the call, I guess it comes from your heart Cause when your head's right You take your time, there's something about the love that makes you light Fire when the strobe hits you You might remember doing this stretch in PE, and we will be holding this position first, but after, I would like you to pull away from your back. As you can see, I was able to pull away on my right side, but not my left, and I just need to practice and stretch a lot more on my left side. In this position, you're just throwing your arms to the side and as far back as you can. It's pretty self-explanatory, and we'll be doing this 10 times total. 7, 8, 9, 10. That was the last one. Alright, in this stretch, it's important that you keep your hands close together because if you don't, it will be much easier to lay flat and you won't get as deep of a stretch. Clasp your hands together and you're going to bend then straighten your legs. This is also a really great stretch for your pike, so try to push your stomach closer to your legs. As you're doing all this, keep aiming to push your hands lower towards the ground. Bend. Straighten. Bend. Straighten. Last one. Bend. Straighten. And come on up. Here I'm just put here I'm just putting my hands on a wall and leaning forward towards the ground. It's important that you push past your limits. If you are in this position not feeling anything, then you aren't pushing hard enough and you will have no progress. Come on up. For this next stretch, grab a rope or even a towel or scarf and grab the ends of it. You're basically going to copy my motions, but work on keeping your arms straight the entire time. If you're able to do this with ease, then bring your hands closer together on the rope. The closer your hands to get, the closer your hands are on the rope, the deeper of a stretch you will get. I didn't record myself doing it all 10 times because for this stretch, it's more about working at your own pace. Lastly, you'll be grabbing onto that rope and aim to touch your hands to the ground. You can even have a partner push you lower for a greater stretch. This was a little easy for me, so I moved my hands closer together on the rope, but I was still able to touch the ground. So what I must do is bring my feet together and do it from there.
Just see 